Hi, everybody. This is Jeffrey. This is Red Color. This is the uh, weekly reading for the collective for the week of February 19th through the 26th. And the little mini message is open to possibilities. Open to possibilities. Okay. Open to possibilities. Very exciting. All right. And it's the new moon on the 19th, 20th. Um, the book started. You know, what else is new? They wait for me to do the videos. All right. Oh, excuse me. It doesn't even bother me so much anymore. I mean, yeah, it doesn't bother me so much anymore. I'll hypnotize myself. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Interesting. Uh, we start with the queen and then the hermit and then the two. Hmm. So it's interesting because they're both swords, right? So it's really, it's mental and it's ideas and it's messages, excuse me. And, um, and the hermit, interestingly, is um, ruled by Virgo and Virgo is ruled in turn by Mercury. So it's a very, um, there's a real mental focus here. There's a real focus of using your mind to foresee uh, like positive outcomes, to foresee the future, to foresee uh, where you want to move forward because the past is gone. Because this one, the past is gone. Um, and she has a really clear vision of the future. And she's not afraid, afraid to say so. The Queen of Swords is not afraid of anything, not even the King of Swords. <laughs> she ain't afraid of nothing and no one. She uh, is ready to move forward into the future with a clear vision, right? And then we have the Hermit, and it's nice because the Hermit softens it. The Hermit um, is the card of Virgo, like I said, and the Hermit, you know, it's really interesting. So this is what I want to say. It's like, Let's say you have a plan to move to a new place or to get a new job, et cetera, et cetera. And, you know, uh, you know, you mentioned it to a few people and they're like, oh, change, oh, oh. It doesn't matter because the hermit is a solo traveler. She's kind of a solo traveler too, in a way. It's like, it doesn't really matter whether it fits into their idea of where you should live or what kind of job you should have. It doesn't really matter. What matters is, is that, you know, you're paying attention to your own light, to your own vision, to your own direction. That's what matters. Hmm. And I think, you know, it's going to be both mental and intuitive, or I feel that it's going to be both mental and intuitive, because I always read this as a card of uh, intuition. A card of like you know she's she's blindfolded and she's just sitting waiting for the message right in this state of peace and balance in a way and the two swords are like antennae coming down and you know giving her the um the vision the faith and and the more like the um the vision the the vision the understanding it's like yeah this is what i really want right? So it's interesting. It's like, let's say you want a new house, right? Or you want to move. I, I don't think it's enough to say I want to move. It's like, I want to, why do I want to move? Why do I want to move? I want to move to be more comfortable. I want to move to be closer to where I work. I want to move to be um, closer to nature, closer to convenience. Um, maybe it's economical it's it, like at the end of the day you have to answer those questions like what's the most important thing and how am i going to get there all right yeah and you're not quite sure but you're seeing it in your mind's eye you're not it's like i don't know why but i really want to live near the mountains i you know or i really want to live near the shore i really want to live whatever it is in a smaller house, in a bigger house, um, in a uh, different type of community, in a different state, 
et cetera. I'm not really quite sure, but I'm getting this, uh, I'm getting like mm, intuitive information. I'm getting, uh, a calling. Mm -hmm. And it can completely transform my life. And I think it's time for me, when I say me, I mean you, to transform my life. You know, so as many of you know, I moved to Mexico. It's, um, it's almost a year. So March 12th will be a year. Maybe I'll have a party. And um, with the pinata, but I need something to hang it from. If I'm going to have it on the roof. There's nothing to hang it from. Okay. Um, and you know, it's big, a big. It's been a big adjustment on many, many, many on every level, and it's a complete transformation of me and my my life, my my attitude, my identity, my everything. And um, I feel like it's the best thing I've ever done for myself. <laughs> actually <laughs> you know probably sometimes it's a little scary but it's like so you know sometimes it's a little frustrating it's like so you know it could have been the same thing if i moved across the hall too i mean maybe not to that extent but you know yeah because i don't want to this is what it's about this is what it's about i just got it this is about freedom this is about freedom Freedom from the shackles of the past, freedom from what everyone thinks, freedom from maybe there's an economic freedom. Maybe there is a freedom like, oh, OK, well, I, I decided to live in a less expensive space, um, make less money. Uh, I just I want freedom. I, you know, I want to be able to have more time off. I want to be able to garden more. I want to be able to walk around in nature more. I want to be able to uh, knit more. It's about freedom. That's what I'm really getting. Yeah, it's about freedom. Very interesting. All right. Uh, extended readings are available for members. Membership is $4.99 a month. Please become a member. And you can watch the extended of uh, this reading and all the 12 signs as well. All month. So that's a lot of videos. Blessings. It should be a very interesting new moon. See you soon.